Hi, Nicholas here with MedTech, and David Sylvan has joined us. UH Ventures, innovating their way across the USA. Nicholas, thanks for uh, having me. Beautiful place, beautiful room. Thank you. And in, in what way is the, the crossover between innovation and healthcare going at the moment in the US? You know, unless we continue to relentlessly innovate, um, the, our ability to deliver care to our patients is going to stagnate. Uh, the irony is healthcare sort of sits at the cutting edge of innovation, and yet the business of healthcare sort of languishes. So we're trying to bridge the gap between the two. Delivery of care from the clinical tools and decision support and outcomes perspective, as well as try to perfect the business of healthcare, the back office, supply chain, revenue cycle, those types of elements. Great, great. Running the, the day-to-day in across hundreds of hospitals, GP offices, this is UH's way? Co- correct. So we partner with hospitals all over the, the country. Our system specifically is 21 hospitals. Uh, we're in Ohio, which is in the Midwest, which is ironic. It's neither in the middle nor in the West, but uh, it's in the Midwest of the United States. But we're a sort of metaphor for what so-called middle market healthcare looks like in America. And so we partner with our peers across the country. Right. And how does economies of scale help by having more institutions under your wing? You know, there are tons of solutions being offered. If each solution only ends up getting some type of traction, Nicholas, at one system, it's got an N of one, and its chance of scaling and surviving is pretty low. If we can create some type of force multiplication, somehow get that traction at multiple sites simultaneously, you end up with a better product. Great, and and you come to conferences like this looking for those those, those valuable insights and where the innovations are coming in order to stay ahead of the game? Exactly, we can't be myopic to think that we can solve for all of our own problems or that we can be American-centric in that regard. So we look to technology ideas, we look to insights from a strategic perspective, we look for co-investors. Brilliant. Yeah. Um, it's the start of the event. I can't ask you really how, how, how it's gone in that way. Uh, you came in late last night. Yep. Initial impressions? Well, first of all, beautiful place, to be quite candid. I'm not sure I would have found Malta on my own from a tourist perspective had it not been for the conference. So I'm grateful for the opportunity to explore a new place, meet new people. Brilliant. And anything you'd like to put out there as a poll for people to come talk to you in the future? What would you like to say? Yeah, so what I'd like to say is uh, we're open for business. We've created a so-called living lab type environment within our healthcare system, all the way from primary care, all the way to to tertiary, quaternary. Uh, I'd like to say if you can make it work within our system, you can probably make it work anywhere. And uh, we look forward to hearing from you. Great. David Sylvan, UH Ventures, thanks for joining us at MedTech. Thank you, Nicholas.